it was amazing to see all of the community members, not just in Danville, but all of Vermilion County come together. This is a follow-up for you. The Vermilion County Animal Shelter has bounced back after suffering with no AC about a week ago. Dozens of people came to support the shelter by taking in animals and keeping them cool. As we told you last night, some went from fostering to adopting. WCI3's Jared Thomas explains what that means to the facility. It's a different scene here at the Vermilion County Animal Shelter. It's a lot cooler and more empty. It was unbearably hot. I would have never had my house this warm. And the cats were so lethargic. The dogs were lethargic. It was absolutely miserable. Bonnie McLean was one of the people who took an animal home to make sure they weren't suffering in that heat. She decided to make it permanent. And what's better than one orange cat? Two orange cats. Cecilia Brown and her sister have been fostering animals from the shelter for more than six years. She says seeing the animals in this situation was painful. People sitting in the parking lot just with dogs in their cars just to keep them cool. Um, but yeah, it, it was a sad situation too. The Vermillion County Shelter has had a rough ride to start out the year, dealing with respiratory illness, no dog food, and no AC. Doing everything we can possible to keep the animals out of the shelter. Um, it would, we just really need a new facility to be able to provide that. Kathleen Orca has asked the county for that, but until that change, she says they'll keep doing what they can and thanking the community. It helps all of these too. It helps the animals in need, gets them out of where, you know, they're living in cages and they're not getting as much socialization. Three, everybody knows how much benefit you get from having a pet in your home and in your life. Reporting in Danville, Jared Thomas, WCI3, your local news leader. Managers at the shelter say they're pushing for a new building. Three months ago, they had a survey done for someone to do a walkthrough of the current facility for suggestions on how to make it better. 